Hi St. Paul's and Happy New Year. I think you're aware that right now the in-person component of our Sunday services is paused right now and it will be through this week, January the 9th. We're going to have some conversations this week to determine when it's going to make the most sense for us to reopen that part of our Sunday mornings. Right now guidelines are changing so quickly um, that we just want to be able to provide a very stable reopening for both you and for our volunteer teams who support our Sunday morning. So we'll be in touch about when we anticipate being able to reopen in person. However, in the meantime, we will continue to live stream on Sunday mornings at 10 a.m. Now on that, uh, apologies for yesterday morning. Our uh, live stream platform that we usually use just wasn't functioning. That was completely out of the control of our tech team. But I'm so glad that so many of you found your way to YouTube and were able to join us there. Also online, one of the things that you can sign up for is for our virtual communion on January the 16th at 11.15 in the morning. So when you sign up for that, then we'll send you a link a couple of days ahead of the communion day and you'll be able to join and be a part of that. Hope to see you there. With changing guidelines, I just wanted to flag those for you who are gathering in small groups. There is a, a new capacity limit on indoor gatherings. And so if you are in the habit of gathering indoors right now, please check those limits. If you need help to move virtually, if you need help with a Zoom account because your numbers exceed um, what you can safely gather with, then just please reach out to our office and we will be very happy to help set you up with a virtual meeting opportunity. And small group leaders will be in touch with more recommendations as we see these guidelines start to settle. But if you have any questions, please just reach out at any time. Now we're in January and as we've been talking about for the last few weeks, we are doing as a church community a one month challenge. And this is where we're taking one month to intentionally focus on those habits that position us for God's presence in our lives. And each week we are going to highlight one of those habits in particular with a video that we send out. If you've subscribed to receive the challenge emails, then you've already had access to that video. But if not, if you missed it, we'll include a link to that below this video as well so that you can watch that. If you think that you've missed the opportunity to join, it is not too late. Please just sign up and join in when you sign up. You have the option of receiving emails, the option of joining the WhatsApp group, or just able, are able to say, hey, I'm in, and uh, you don't need any extra support from us in this. One more thing before I leave, I wanted to say thank you uh, for your generosity and giving to our Christmas project, which went to help families in Dominican Republic through our uh, partner church, New Song Church. And so, Thanks to your generosity, we were able to meet our target and help 25 families. And Pastor Jose, who uh, coordinated all of this, has sent us some photos and videos back. And so we're, we want to share those with you. And there will be a link to that below this video, and we'll also circulate that at another time. Thanks so much for being that kind of a community. I hope you have a great week. Go in peace, St. Paul's.